Hey guys, it's that time of year. All the leaves are off the trees and we feel vulnerable, naked and afraid. And the natural tendency is to climb higher, but that's a catch 22. I've seen some people posting on social media, they're climbing as high as 25 feet and um, that can be a problem. So if you think about it, if you're hunting with a recurve or longbow and you're say you're holding yourself to 20 yards, you draw a 20 yard circle around your tree at let's say 15 feet above the ground. As you go up 20 feet and above, that circle gets exponentially smaller. And so you're narrowing or narrowing the, you know, the, the range in which you can shoot, but you're also increasing the angle of the shot, which is a problem as well. And so staying 20 feet and below is ideal. Uh, there's several things you can do um, one, use evergreen trees, try to get beside them, use them for concealment. Uh, beech trees hold their, their leaves a little bit later in the year, as I mentioned in another video, or a turn in the trail. And that's what I'm doing this morning. I'm on a spur off of this ridge and these deer come around it. So as they're coming around it, they're kind of coming toward me, but then they turn. All I have to do is remain undetected till they turn, they focus in a different direction and I get a shot. Same thing's true when they're coming the opposite direction. But getting high and taking those really steep shots, you, you increase your uh, likelihood of error because number one, your target's smaller, it's narrower. But also if you shoot down into a deer and you don't get an exit wound, you get no blood trail. They bleed out internally and so it can be tough to find them. So try to find ways to stay 20 feet and below and I think you'll have better luck. Best of luck to you. I hope you're having a great season.